the encouragement today is to have a relationship with the Father that engages your heart, your mind, and your soul. Be aware of his sovereignty as you worship, not just when you're afraid or in trouble. Don't acknowledge his supreme power over your life just when you're in trouble. Acknowledge it in worship every time. And have reverence for the one true God at all times. Because what it looks like to live as a worshiper is to be consistently and continuously choosing to sit at his feet rather than trying your own perspectives on everything else going around you. 